On Sunday night, tragedy struck a family in Warren Creek as a gunman fired several shots at a family in the Capitol Hill area of the village. According to reports, 49-year-old Marcel Neal and 47-year-old Seda Paris and their 15-year-old son were already in ben bed, that is, when a masked gunman entered their home and fatally shot both adults and injured the minor, who was transported to the hospital for treatment. ACP Hilberto Romero shared details of the investigation with the media today. Information is that both were at their house at Warren Creek when a person with a firearm entered and fired shots towards Seda Paris, causing her fatal injuries. Thereafter, Marcel uh, appeared and he was also shot. Uh, we are trying to establish a motive for this murder. Uh, for this murder is the same. Do you know if uh, if the either of them were the target? Was it the man or the woman? Uh, the information we have got out that the female was the target. Uh, oh. She was shot and when the other person uh, showed up, he was also shot. So it had nothing to do with an alcoholic situation involving the man? Again, we are looking at several uh, leads but we have not established fully the motive at this time what about suspects right uh, no not no suspects at this time commissioner of police chester williams said that they are still investigating the motive but they do not believe it is linked in any way to gangs in the area Murder, from what we gather so far, um, has nothing to do with those persons who are part of the SOE. Um, if a matter of fact, the, the, the victims um, are not known to be involved in drugs or guns or anything, other than the fact that we know that the, the deceased husband was somewhat of an alcoholic. Um, what we're gathering that there was some dispute with some people um, yesterday, and that may, is what may have led to that particular murder. Um, we're still trying to confirm certain things, and we're hoping that by the end of the day today, we should be able to get um, more clarity in terms of what transpired leading to um, that double murder. Was a child injured in an incident? Yes, the, the son of the two deceased um, persons um, was injured and is hospitalized at this time. Perez's eldest sister said that the family was not close to her as she was very reserved. But she said her sister did not have any issues with anyone and the incident came as a shock to the family. She said the family migrated over from Guatemala when both were young and they have always stayed out of drama. She added that the couple leaves behind the injured son and three adult daughters.